Dave, how are you tracking so far this pre-season? Obviously, it's a long road back from that injury. Yeah, um, going well, mate. I've completed you know, probably 80 to 90% of the pre-season. Um, obviously, still getting uh, managed through um, managed through each session and and probably not doing the entire load at the moment. So, um, But I've done all the footy sessions, uh, which is sort of the aim going into the pre-season and, and doing all the match sim and, and that sort of stuff. So, uh, so far, tracking really well and, and just enjoying each session as it comes. What's the goal for you? Is it playing in the JLT Community Series or is it more looking towards Round 1 at the moment or what is it? Yeah, I think I'll just have to sit down with, with Justin and, and Rocket and sort of put a bit of plan in place and uh, yeah, decide what games to play and um, you know, hopefully give myself the best chance of being fit and for, for Round 1. So hopefully, whether that's you know, 1, 2 or 3, or, or, um, you know, we'll just wait and see. And what are your goals for the 2017 season? Is it just staying on the park? Have you set yourself uh, anything higher than that? Uh, to be honest, I haven't really sat down and, and, and had too many goals at this stage. It's probably more just um, yeah, that continuity of, of training and, and playing. So um, you know, I have, I've only played six games in the last two years. So if I can and have a full season of, of playing footy, then um, you know, that's, that, that'll be uh, yeah, my, my biggest aim at this stage. Leadership group announcement today. It must be nice to see a couple of new faces in the group. Yeah, it's good. It's good for the club. Um, obviously, the inclusion of Took and... Um, and Mickey Barlow as well, so um, and and obviously uh, Maisie and Tommy stepping as co-captains, who you know did a lot of did a lot of work over the last few years, and um, you know I think they're they're really setting the standard for the club uh, moving forward. What has Mickey Barlow brought to the club since he's arrived here? I think he's just uh, he's got good uh, good footy IQ, and um, you know he's also very vocal out on the track, and um, I guess coming from an experienced side like Fremantle, which is uh, uh, from all reports very. Um, you know, a, a great club, so it um, just brings that experience and, and another uh, different look at things. And would you say he really drives standards on the track? He seems to. Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, you know, he's, a, he's a fantastic trainer, so um, you know, he's always leading by example and, um, and definitely by his voice as well. Thanks for your time. Cheers.